Welcome back. Commander, Stevens wants me to personally thank you for the job you've done here. W wait a minute. Now, Commander, we will try again. Get this plane refueled. We have another mission for you to fly. No one gets off that mountain alive. Yes, sir. That was a bit unkind. Ooh, we got to play as Leon again. Teresa, come in. I'm out of the holding complex. I read you. What's your plan? First, I'm gonna find a decent silenced weapon in case I run into any agency operatives. Then I'll have to find some way to get into that air traffic control tower. After all that, finding a chopper to hit your ride on should be a piece of cake. How you holding up? I've been better. Out. Ballard, one of the feds needs a lift over the main gate. I want you to double time it over to admin and drive the truck for him. Who are these guys, Sarge? What the hell are they up to? Don't ask questions, Airman. Just move. Yes, sir. Yeah, you know better to ask uh, questions like that. Unless you want to end up like that commander who got shot during the cutscene by Morgan. Tase you. And let's see what we got. We just picked up the M16, but we still have the equipment from the airbase. And don't mind this guy. He won't bother to turn around. He's too scared right now. That something might happen to him. What took you so long? I've been waiting here for 10 minutes. Yes, sir. I'm supposed to be at the main gates clearing a shipment. If I'm late, I'll have you busted down, Airman. Sorry, sir. I'll get you there. Teresa, I've got something. I think I just saw Thomas Holman here at the base. We went through agency training together. Holman? Don't know him. He was assigned to the FEMA unit. I'm betting he'll know where the labs are. So what are you gonna do? I'm gonna get him to tell me. Yeah, she's gonna do it the easy way or the hard way. And with Leon, well, I suggest you take the easy way. Alright, that truck just left, and we have one, two guards to deal with. We can't kill them, because it's considered collateral damage. And these guys have nothing to do with the agency. They're just here to protect the base. They're not victims. Well, they're victims, but they're not bad guys. So we can't kill anyone. But we can get spotted, because if we do, then, well, the mission fails. It's another stealth mission. Quickly tase him, and grab the equipment in the back of the truck. Good thing we got a checkpoint. If we were playing the first siphon filter, it would have took a long time to get at least one checkpoint throughout the level. And you could roll behind these guys as much as you want, they won't even hear you. Now that we picked up the rifle, we won't need it. We're going to be using the taser for the majority of the mission. Oh, I see one guy there. So let's just climb down here. Hopefully don't alert them. Did you hear that? Hear what? I thought I heard something. I'll go check it out. Okay, this is going to get a little tricky since there are two guards. Alright, one is leaving his post. And one is just standing there, so we're going to climb the truck. And what we're going to do is wait for him to pass. Just a little bit. This is not like Splinter Cell, you could jump on top of people to, like, knock them out. It doesn't work that way. Come on, climb down, Leon. Oh my god, I have to roll down there. Come on, come on, before he gets to the other side. Because if he does, I can't tase him. There we go. That was way too close. Carefully climb this. Do it in the most quietest way you can. Roll down there if you have to. Because if you just jump down there, the noise will attract the guard's attention and the mission will fail. I want my chopper cleared for immediate takeoff. Put the second chopper on standby. I'll be there shortly. The rest of the cargo looks secure. Everything from Farcom West is now accounted for. 
Sir, the F-22 is refueled and ready for takeoff, but the payload you are waiting for hasn't gotten here yet. Your pilot seemed anxious that I tell you. That'll be all, Airman. Get on the radio and ask Holman what the delay is. Oh, we oh, can't afford any more screw-ups. Come on, come on, come on. Oh, that was close. That was gonna get spotted by him. Just take cover here. And we'll put him right to sleep. Gotta love how these airmen just pause so you can tase them. It's like they want to be tased. And too bad you can't kill those two buttholes. Leon, I've confirmed it with Gates. The agency is going to carpet bomb the mountain with nerve gas. You've got to stop them. I know. I'm going to take out that pilot and sabotage the plane. That should buy Gabe enough time to get off the mountain with any GIs he can save. Right. I'll let him know. Out. Leon and Gabe, they have some special sort of bond together. They always did. I was always beginning to think that if they were in love with each other. Alright, let's press the switch and get into the pilot's room. There are no guards here, so you can just run through this area. But, we're gonna have to pull out the silent sniper rifle, because we're gonna have to kill the pilot. No, sir. I'm sorry, sir. Yes, I have the transport's location, and the tower has cleared me. I'm still waiting for the payload. Evidently, Holman had trouble getting it through the main gates. I'm told it's on its way now. Wow, he flew. What kind of sniper is this? Sabotage the plane. One of my favorite planes. Teresa, radio Gabe and tell him I'm almost clear. He may have a ride yet. You better hurry or he's not gonna need one. He's catching a train. What? I'll explain later. ETA on the chopper? I'm on my way to the tower now. I... Someone's coming. You can't let him find that pilot's body. I know. Out. Yeah, Leon, and your rifle's right exposed right there. It's not a smart move. Let's go back to the taser. And put this guy to sleep, too. And I love the F-22. It's such a beautiful plane. Alright. That takes care of one part of the mission. Now, I noticed... Well, not really noticed. I've been knowing this for a long time that Gabe's missions revolve around action and blowing stuff up and Leon revolves around stealth oriented missions but in the third game you get to blow some stuff up too as Leon so oh yeah there's a spotlight up there strangely enough that if you get spotted by that light you fail the mission and there's nobody guarding the rooftop checkpoint and we have to climb on top of this truck to get across the base so quickly do that and I love the music in this level it's so smooth it sets the mood for the mission really well now climb down and then just run through these guards are too stupid to notice you now this part I do not know. I don't remember. I think there's only one guard or there's no one here. Can't be too sure. Take cover behind this box. Is there a guard here? No. I was wrong. Oh, there's Holman and Morgan. Wasn't that Falcon? Pretty sure it was. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Come on, you can leave. What's the holdup on that F-22 payload? It should be there. I cleared it through the gates myself. Well, let's go see what's holding them up. No! We must leave for New York now if the lab is going to have the time it needs to process this plasma. We don't have the samples from the girl yet. We can begin processing Fagan's sample and do hers when it arrives. Otherwise, the shipment will be delayed. Understood. Get to that other airstrip pronto and check on that F-22 personally. Then get over to the infirmary and see what's holding up that medic. He should be finished with her soon. Right. Should I wait here? Okay, you get the other chopper cleared and ready for takeoff. 
As soon as Holman gets back, I want you to personally deliver the girl's plasma to the labs. Understood. Teresa, Holman separated from the others. This may be my one chance to get to him. I'm gonna make my move now. Great, just don't kill him before you get the information, okay? Got it. Out. I got one question, Leon. How the hell did they not see you when they were standing in front of you? That's something I never got in this game. And another thing, they never seem to stare at each other when they talk. They look around like when they're idling, like Max Payne does, he looks left and right. Wait for this guy to get separated, and we'll tase the uh, guard too. I could do without the escort, Airman. Sir, sorry sir. I want to tell you this guy first, so I want to have to uh, deal with him when I get back. Now we can go deal with Holman. We can't tase him. We can just walk behind him. Oh. oh! Hello, Holman. Standard silence, HK5. Good. Remember me? Leon, you escaped. Thank God. <laughs> Don't even try. I know what you're planning. No, I was trying to stall them, trying to find a way to get you <laughs> off the base without- You just loaded two missiles with Zarin gas payloads into an F-22 meant for the survivors of a plane crash. No, no that's not true, you're I- You're a liar, Holman. And not a very good one. Another agency course you failed in training? You wanna beg for your life? You tell me where Morgan is taking that plasma. I don't know what you're talking about. Oh! I'm dying, Holman. Oh! Siphon filter is killing me, and I am running out of patience. Where are they taking Fagin's plasma? And where were they planning to take mine? I can't help you. I don't know where they're taking the plasma. All I know is I was assigned to Morgan. He said we were picking up biomaterials for transport. Transport to where? I don't know. I only know that our next assignment was to pick up some discs from the Farcom Exposition Center in New York. They don't tell me anything. I was just following orders. Yeah? Well, we were all just following orders. Just make it quick. <gasps> you have no idea what you're involved in. Maybe you'll learn if you'd live long enough. I'd suggest not going into work tomorrow. Your boss might not be as forgiving as I am. Now, Leon is one tough broad. I would not want to mess with her. Is there another guard here? No, we took care of him already. At least I think so. I could have swore there were two guards in this room after we dealt with Holman. You know what's cool also? I cannot wait to use the HK5 pistol. That's gonna be my favorite weapon. Too bad we can't use it yet though. I think it only has 30 clips. Let me check that out. All 32, okay. We'll get some more ammo soon. Ooh, I gotta deal with you. Luckily, I didn't continue forward. Or else I would've got spotted and got really, really mad. Whoa. Please don't spot me, Mr. Guard. Can you see my... Come on. Don't get H -come alert. Damn it. Got an intruder. Be right back, guys. Okay, we're back. I took care of that guard, the one that spotted me before. As you see, he's on the floor now. Taking a nice long nap. I could have easily just ran in here. Because he was just like walking this way to continue his patrol. But I think my mistake was that I crouched and took too long. Alright, I'm going to have to deal with this guard. And I'm guessing it's a spotlight too. So let's pull out the rifle. And then quickly tase the other guy. There we go. I know if I was those two guards across the uh, base right here, I would be able to see Leon, but oh well. This is pretty funny. I like this part. What the hell? Look out! Come on, let's go! <laughs> I love that part. Checkpoint, and now this is the last part of the mission, so just head right up the elevator. Don't head left, because that's the final part of the mission. No, sir. Agent Holman has not checked in yet. The F-22 has been cleared for takeoff, priority one. 
Personnel have not seen it leave the hangar yet. I'll find out, sir. Hey, Sarge, these feds are getting pretty antsy out here. One of them is clear for takeoff. Hold on. Agent Falcon, your chopper is cleared for immediate departure. The F-22 has not cleared its hangar yet. If your other agent is at the airstrip, you can fly directly there and pick him up. And it's that simple. All right. <coughs> I've got a transponder frequency of the downed plane. Now all you need is that ride. I think the agency's provided for me on that one. Falcon's chopper is cleared for takeoff. If I stop him, I can take the chopper and no one's the wiser. <coughs> nice plan. Good luck. If you played this game like so many times, you know what to do automatically. That's what I love about it. It's like all the memories are just glued into my head. Like, oh, this is how I do this part, and I gotta be careful I don't get spotted here. Now, this is where Falcon is, I think. And there's one guard that kind of makes me laugh every time. Just hear the line that he says. Or the way he says it. Alright, I'm through waiting. You stay here. When Agent Holman arrives, tell him to contact me directly, and I'll give him further instructions. Yes, sir. <laughs> now nah, the way he said that, y y yes, sir. Like he got so nervous there. Wow, Falcon, you walk really slow. I wonder if he was going to be the pilot for the Black Hawk. Where the hell is that light shining? Hmm. Teresa. I've got a ride and clearance all the way to the crash site. GSAT's reporting a huge fire, probably caused by the crash, but who knows. Thick smoke is shutting down all flights into the area, so be careful. <coughs> well, considering what those guys could have been breathing, a little smoke won't hurt them. Patch me through to Gabe and wish me luck. You got it. That's a rather stealthy chopper. Doesn't even make any noise when it takes off. Okay, in the next episode, we'll see if Leon saves Gabe. Until next time.